New York City corruption scandal begs a very scary question. Where are the illegal guns believed to be on the street due to this alleged bribing scandal? CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports. Getting the legal right to carry a gun in New York City if you're not a cop is exceedingly rare, and only a few thousand are granted every year, mostly to business owners dealing in cash, jewelers, and celebrities, which is why it is such a shocker. 44 year old Alex Shia Lichtenstein is charged with bribing NYPD officials to get gun permits for people. We need to get the guns off the streets. I think there just needs to be some real reform. Lichtenstein allegedly bragged he paid out $6,000 per permit and did it 150 times. Times, but where are all the illegally permitted guns now? Unfortunately, we're not going to know. At least not in the short term, says retired NYPD Detective Sergeant Joseph Jackalone. The correct way to do this is go back for the last 10 years or so and see who's been getting permits, if they should have been or not. Unfortunately, this is going to be a huge undertaking, but you got to do it. Investigators identified and reassigned two officers who allegedly handled the permits. Police say every license they touched will be reviewed and background checks done. Will they be able to get all the guns back? We wanted NYPD's Chief of Department James O'Neill to answer that when we found him at the scene of an unrelated drug sting. The, the gun corruption probe, anything... No, we're, not talking about, we're not talking about anything except... I just, I just want to concentrate on this right now. Okay. So no official comment on this case that only came to light after Lichtenstein allegedly tried to bribe an honest officer who took the matter straight to internal affairs. Investigators say they found a case dating back to 2013 where Lichtenstein's credit card was used to purchase a permit that went to a man who had a lengthy criminal record. The top to bottom review of the license division is in the early stages and more arrests are expected. In East Harlem, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News. Lichtenstein is out of jail on bond of half a million dollars. If convicted, he faces up to 10 years in prison. Is it a 